What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? Back for the fourth time today, I might add. But unfortunately, I have way worse news than anything I've brought so far today. Lonzo Ball has entered NBA health and safety protocols. Now, this was something that, again, just looking at the way that the season's been going for the Bulls and the way that the virus has been making its way through teams, we should at this point, especially with the um, um, Omarion <laughs> Omicron variant, we should completely expect at some point every member of our roster go through it and unfortunately now it's Lonzo Ball you know we've been saying how we have the full complement of players back this is a major major loss for the Bulls and I know that some for the people who go to like just looking at the point output or anything like that it may not seem that it's going to be a big loss but what Lonzo does in communicating to this Bulls team and his and his teammates about the uh what the teams other teams are doing on offense and just being as versatile he is defensively is going to be a huge 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 loss for the Chicago Bulls in their next upcoming games now we know that the Hawks are also losing losing players I think uh Collins went down as well so he's going to be out when we play them in our home and home but without that being said this is going to be a big loss and this is going to be one that's that's felt and it's going to be key we're now going to see how how DeMar and Levine do running a team more so than what they have been, right? And as far as like really stepping up, one of them is going to have to really, really step up defensively. I think sometimes we underestimate and forget just how much Lonzo makes the other teams better defenders around him. And then when we're also losing, uh, we're missing Caruso on top of that. We're lo we're gonna we're missing two of our most versatile defenders that we have on this team at, as a whole. This is going to be a big, big hit to the Bulls in a lot of different areas. This is going to this is one that's going to hurt, right? This is one that's going to hurt now with Levine uh, saying that and we've been talking about Levine being an improved defender. We're going to have to see that now because he is going to have to guard the team's best guard, period. Um, now, what does this do for the starting lineup? Um, especially now, McKinney being out, I would think that he would step up and go into that position. Uh, we're probably going to see Io DeSumo start at point guard this game. And that is going to be, it's going to be interesting to see a rookie step up in, in, in that position. But more than likely, unless unless the Bulls do something weird with where they start Levine um, at point guard or something like that, Levine, I mean, uh, Io DeSumo is going to get his first, not his first NBA start, because he started before us, I think for us before when we were out with injury, but his first start at the point guard position. And we're really going to get to take a look at what he looks like being out there as a starter playing heavy minutes, he's going to have to play a lot of minutes tonight. Now, I had said previously before how missing Alfonso may not hurt as much with everything else that we have back. Now, with this news, it's definitely going to hurt a little bit more. The Bulls players are going to have to step up. The little preview video that I dropped, all that changes now with Lonzo being out. And this is this is where I think a lot of people are going to see. For anyone who's just a stat sheet person or whatever else, is going to really see the benefit and what Lonzo really brings to this team. This is a loss that hurts, and it's going to hurt majorly for the Chicago Bulls. Let me know down below what, how you think the Bulls are going to overcome this. How do you think Io DeSumo, now th this is, again, this is speculation on my part, but how do you think Io is going to do with starting uh, tonight? Um, this is this is major. This is major. Let me know all your thoughts down below, all the good stuff. If you want to send a text message or voicemail, 773-270-2799. I'm not going to do my whole little out. I've done it like four times today. Um, I still have a live stream and a halftime hangout that we're going to go through tonight. This is a... The bull said, "Hey, Hayes took the day off. Hold my beer." Um, but this is again video number four. Like I liked in every, every every episode on. I love you guys. Go Bulls. Peace. This has been a presentation of the Break Break Media. Media.